Let me show you guys how I rig to catch black crappie. Nothing too crazy. All I have here is a slip bobber, a swivel, some bobber stops, and some split shot sinkers. Bait of choice, just a little jig, nothing too crazy. Anyways, hey, let me get down into this and show you guys what's going on. Bobber stops come in many different styles. My preferred type are the disposable rubber type that slip over your line. First, you slip your line through the bobber stop loop and then double the line back on itself while pulling the rubber stop onto the line. Once the stop is on, you will then run the line through the hole in the slip bobber. I then attach a swivel with a clinch knot. I add more line to the other side of the swivel. Then I finish with the jig of my choice. Today, I am using a 16th ounce jig head with a chartreuse jig body. The color of my lure is determined by the time of year and water clarity. Crappie are fairly aggressive feeders. If you're not getting bites, mix up the color or jig sizes. Really quickly, let's walk through our setup before we get out there and catch some crappie. So again, we have our rubber bobber stop right there. Hope you can see that. That rubber bobber stop is adjustable. You can squeeze it up or down depending on the depth of where you want to fish. You know, the higher you go, the deeper that line's gonna be allowed to sink down in the water. The shallower you go, the, the farther down the line you go, the less that bobber is gonna be allowed to move. Some days, you know, you're in really shallow water, you slide that all the way down and you touch the bobber and it's, it's, it's stationary, it won't move. A little bit of deeper water, you know, you, you slide it up and you can get anywhere of, you know, six, seven feet of depth on this thing if you need it. But anyways, hey, again, bobber stop, slip bobber. Beneath the slip bobber, we have the barrel swivel. Beneath the barrel swivel, we have a little bit of lead. Some people use like a slip, like a slip egg sinker or something like that. I always just use a split shot. You don't, you don't need a whole lot to get it down there because your jig head, your jig head is lead, so it's gonna sink naturally. And then here at the end, you know, you have your jig. I'm just fishing a two inch tube, nothing crazy. Crappie go crazy for it. All this stuff can be picked up at your local sportsman's warehouse, Walmart. Most grocery stores carry this stuff super basic but yeah that's my setup super basic nothing crazy you can use this to catch black crappie bluegill sunfish perch anyways let's get out there and catch some crappie yeah catch you out there smallest crappie ever that's a good one though right in front of the camera look at that got one buddy I had one too here comes Warren Warren with the crappie monster there's the fish oh I see you took the top of that foot just now Okay, yeah, that was too deep. Totally too deep. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> God, too much slack on my Is he on? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> you ever fish a bait caster? Just bought my first one today. I'm over here changing out the battery and Warren's like, where's your bobber? There it is. 
Oh, she's long gone. Yeah, not bad. Big enough to pull the bobber under. Oh, got action. No dog, right? Had my daughter riding around my dad's backyard with that sled, and we were just ripping that place off. It was so much fun. Double double. Golly, there she is. Warren with the double, ladies and gents. That is unscripted. That is natural. Those were two natural fish that he just hooked into. Man, Warren. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Beast mode right there. <laughs> Heck yeah, Warren. It's the only way to get a fight with these little guys. <laughs> catch two at a time. What would Warren do? He'd catch two, two crappie at the same time. <laughs> oh man, that was fun. Double, double animal style. So I used to work for a company called Bio. Got one? Got something. I think a little bass or something. Well, I worked for Bio West. Um, we came out here once to do a survey on. on. Yeah, he's still on. Little guy. Oh, it's a bit. That's, that's a good crappie, dude. Look at that thing. Oh no, that's. Oh yeah, dang, that's a. That's a dandy. That's a big crappie. Don't don't. Ah, oh, he's gonna put that in there, man. Let's pull that. Look at that. Holy, that is a nice crappie, man. Wow, I thought that was a bass, man. Man, he is. Well, I guess if anything, you can cross the crappie off your list. Yeah. I'm not. <laughs> Man, I forgot how spiky they are. Oh, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Here we go. Here we go. I forget crappie grab them from the back. Look at that sucker. We were throwing lures for musky, but ended up smacking a dang nice black crappie on a fast retrieve. Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed species number seven, black crappie. Please, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. Seeing the number of my subscribers goes up makes me happier than a fat kid at McDonald's. There we go, 12 inch crappie. Big old black crappie here in northern Utah with the Captain Jordan Duel over here. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Anyways, bye little guy. Out of here. I'm so bad at YouTube, man. I have no idea what I'm doing. Talking to a camera.